This is the Dunure Labyrinth, as seen from Dunure Castle. A labyrinth is usually distinguished from a maze, and a maze has a series of blind-ending turnings that try to prevent you from getting to the centre, whilst a labyrinth takes you to the centre, although it takes you in a long, circular fashion. The labyrinth at Dunure is very well maintained. It was created by the local community something like 20 years ago or so. There was a grant towards its construction. Many of the stones came from an old rockery. Labyrinths are very well known throughout the world. The famous Greek ones, the British ones, particularly the Scilly Islands, uh, the turf mazes. It's said in some countries like Scandinavia, they were placed deliberately next to the sea because they were used for trapping the evil spirits that would cause storms. Some labyrinths are found within cathedrals, such as in France, where they are as patterns on the pavement within the, within the cathedral, and the last act of a pilgrimage or a pilgrim would be to crawl on their knees towards the centre. It's also said they have a, a general religious meaning in the sense of it's the, the one way, the one path, the true path, because there's one way to the centre, to the goal. They can be of varying complexity. They're quite easy to create in terms of draw, but they take a great deal of material, as you can see here, to, to actually put them together. They can be either right or left-handed as you enter. It's said to be especially bad luck to cheat and uh, jump over one of the barriers. <laughs> 